Hi, my name is Sabina Simonero, and I'm a Learning Solutions Specialist here at Harvard Business Publishing. Today we're going to walk through together how to tailor for your single sign-on the asset deep links found inside HMM's Topic Buzz Kits. So let's dive right in. First off, let's highlight where to find HMM's Topic Buzz Kits. We're going to go inside the Admin Console, click on the Admin Resources tab at the top right here, check the box next to Marketing and Promotional Materials, and then scroll down until you find Topic Buzz Kits and click on the zip file links here. Here we have the Topic Buzz Kit for Change Management. You can see how there are a series of deep links for videos, articles, tools, and so on. And if we were to hover over the deep links, you'll see how they all start with the generic myhvp.org. And that's the part of the link that we'd like to tailor for your single sign-on. So to do that, we're going to click anywhere inside the Buzz Kit. We're going to hold down two keys, Alt and F9, which opens up the hyperlinks. Next, we're going to hold down the Control and H keys together, which pops up two boxes where we see Find What and Replace With. So we want to find that generic link that starts with myhvp.org, and we want to replace it with a tailored link for our single sign-on. And that's going to start with your subdomain followed by a dot that precedes myhvp.org. Now, if you're not sure what your subdomain is, it would be great to check with the client success team or your technical engagement manager, for example. Our subdomain here at Harvard Business Publishing is HBP. So we would put HBP dot before myhbp.org. But for the purposes of today, let's simply put subdomain dot before myhbp.org. And again, this is the part that tailors for your single sign-on, and it's really critical to ensure you have the correct subdomain. Uh, let's click Replace All. It's going to replace all of those links and convert them. There are nine replacements because there's nine assets. We'll click OK and Close. And then finally, we're going to click back inside the Buzz Kit and hit the Alt and F9 keys together, and we'll see how all of those deep links have been converted, if you will, um, accordingly. So just as a quick recap, here are the three steps for tailoring your asset deep links found inside the, the topic buzz kits for your single sign-on. A quick note again is if you're not sure what the subdomain is, it would be great to check with your technical engagement manager or the client success team, for example. And also an important note is uh, that if you have an IDP connection, it would be great to work with your technical engagement manager uh, on what the best options are for deep linking, uh, for the, the structure of the deep link, uh, which might be different. Thanks, everybody, and hope this was helpful for tailoring your deep links.